Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it is Saturday, so it's grocery haul day. I have a pretty good size haul from you and some really good deals currently going on that you're not going to want to miss. So if you're excited for the grocery haul, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I upload a grocery haul every Saturday and five videos every single week. Down in the description box, you will find nutrition coaching. Highly recommend those custom to you macros and calories. That is what I follow to lose 140 pounds and have since maintained that weight loss as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for questions, accountability, or to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and come join our free Facebook group. We would love to have you. So let's jump in to this week's grocery haul. So here is my grocery haul for the week. I shopped at my local Fry store, which is a Kroger store. They're having some really good deals right now. A lot of their products are buy one, get one free. So this is definitely the time to shop. So let me show you what I picked up for the week. So the first thing I grabbed is the Caesar salad pasta. I thought Troy would like this. I always like to grab him a potato salad, macaroni salad, pasta. If they have something in the deli that's reduced and I've never tried this, he's never tried this. I think this will be easy for him as a side dish when he's making a sandwich for lunch. So I picked that up. I also grabbed these. They only had very, they had like three things in the reduced bakery. One of them was this marshmallow filled mini donut. It sounds very sweet. I did grab it for him though. He'll eat these. I definitely won't. These are 200 calories a piece. So just not something that I'm going to have. I did grab something else that I am going to have. So I'll show you that. Or today, when you see this video, I'm actually at Patagonia Lake here in Arizona with my boot camp group. It's our girls day. We are spending the day at the lake. It's going to be the first time I get to take out my kayak and I am making a snack mix and little mini sandwiches to take. Julia, my boot camp instructor asked for or something with mini peanut butter cups. I don't know why, that's what she wanted. So I found this really good recipe online for a mix that has mini peanut butter cups. I'll actually pop on the screen here the actual recipe for you if you're interested in making it for yourself. But one of the things in that mix is chocolate chip. So I grabbed some milk chocolate chip. I did grab two gallons of 1% milk for Troy for the week. And then I picked up these little mini sugar cookies. I will eat these. These are the perfect size. You just have one, satisfies the sweet tooth. They weren't in the reduced section. Like I said, there was literally three things and I grabbed one of the three, but these were only $5.99. So not a bad price. And I like to have something sweet, dessert-like on hand for the week. And then I got this Panera Ranch dip. This was on reduction for $2.25. It sounds really good. We have been on a veggie and ranch, veggie and dip kick. I bought some cucumbers too, so I grabbed that. I thought we would try it. And then here are those milk chocolate peanut butter cups. These were $9. That's insane. I was actually going to go to Sprouts and get them out of the bulk section, but I thought by the time I drive there, the gas that I spend, the time that I spend, I'm not really saving a lot of money, so I spent the $9 and bought this, so I hope Julia enjoys her little mini peanut butter cups. I'm going to make, like I said, little sandwiches for the lake day, so I grabbed these little rolls from the bakery. These are just the perfect size for mini sandwiches. In that snack mix, it calls for Reese's Pieces, so I picked those up. I needed diced ham for my breakfast meal prep, but a lot of cheese because we needed cheese slices for the week, and then again, I need them for these little mini sandwiches. Right now, Sargento's buy one, get one free. So that makes each pack of cheese only $2. So really, really good price. So I'm going to use the Baby Swiss on the sandwiches. I did grab some Colby Jack. That's Troy's favorite cheese. I love sharp cheddar. And then I also got the ultra thin Colby Jack. So when I want a little less calories, a little less fat, I'll reach for the ultra thin. But again, buy one, get one free, excellent deal. And then their lunch meat, the Kroger brand was $3.99. So I picked up some oven roasted turkey breast and some turkey pastrami for the little mini sandwiches for the lake. I got some more instant rice for Lola for her chicken and rice. I've been making that for her since she's been in chemo. She's really not interested in her kibble, but she'll eat chicken and rice. So every other day I give her some. Instant rice just makes my life so easy. So I picked that up. And then I needed half and half for a recipe. And then also when I make my lavender iced coffee, I put half and half in there. So I picked that up. I also was completely out of unsweetened applesauce. So I grabbed the big container. And then we're also completely out of light mayo. This was $6. When did mayonnaise become $6? That is so crazy to me. The Duke's brand was buy one, get one free, but it has way more calories and fat in the light mayo than this one. I don't know why. And I thought I'm gonna save the calories and the 
that and just suck up the six bucks for the craft light mayo. And then their French's mustards are buy one, get one free. Troy goes through a lot of mustard. He puts these on his breakfast sandwiches. And then I also wanted mustard for the little sandwiches that I'll be making for the lake. I needed a can of corn for my lunch meal prep, as well as a can of black beans. And then a little can of tomato sauce for a recipe. Hash rounds for my breakfast meal prep. And then what's ever left over, I use these in my protein bowl where I do hash browns and egg, cottage cheese and bacon, or some type of meat, maybe sausage, whatever I have on hand. It's such a delicious filling breakfast. I've showed it in multiple what I eat in a day videos. And these are the hash browns that I prefer to use versus the frozen. So what's ever left over, I will put those into the protein bowls. I also got some mini pretzels. It calls for peanut butter filled pretzels in the little snack mix, but that's a lot of peanut butter, like a lot, a lot. It actually calls for peanut butter chips, which I have on hand. So I opted for just regular pretzels for crunch and salt. And then their two good yogurts were, if you buy six, they're 99 cents a piece. That's a great deal. So I got two strawberry and then four of the Meyer lemon. That is my favorite two good yogurt and it is seasonal. So again, 99 cents a piece, killer deal. And then for produce, I have a zucchini. This is for my lunch meal prep, a red onion for my lunch meal prep, as well as a green pepper. I needed sliced mushrooms for a dinner recipe, bananas for my meal prep. And then of course I like bananas on my yogurt bowls. And like I said, I've been on a banana kick lately. I'm still kind of on the banana kick. So I grabbed those. Here's the mini cucumbers. These are $2.99 right now on digital coupon. I almost got two bags, but I was afraid that we wouldn't eat them in time. And my plan is to pair those mini cucumbers with the ranch dip. And we also have some baby carrots in the fridge. And right now, grapes, red, green, or black grapes are 99 cents a pound. This entire bag of grapes cost me $2. So I thought that would be a great fruit for the week. And I think I'm even going to take some with me to the lake just so that I have a fruit. I don't know if anybody else is bringing fruit. So I think I'm going to bring that with me. And then in the garage, I have an eight pack of Gatorade Zero and a 24 pack of Diet Coke, which right now is $11.99. So again, a really good deal for Troy for the week. So that's everything that I picked up. Let's jump into what's for dinner and what you'll see in Monday's meal prep. So for dinners this week, I'm going to be making spaghetti pie. You guys will actually see that recipe in Wednesdays, what I eat in a day. And then Troy wants a taco night and a pizza night. And then for meal prep, I'm making a ham, egg and cheese, hash brown muffins for breakfast. I'm so excited for those. For lunch, I'm doing a chicken burrito bowl. And then for dessert, I'm making banana bread with chocolate chips. I mean, what could be better? So stay tuned on Monday for all three recipes. Thank you for joining me for this week's grocery haul. I hope I gave you some really good ideas of some healthy things that you can pick up for the week. I will also put the recipe for the little peanut butter snack mix down in the description box for you if you're interested in making that. You'll also find nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things, and again, my free supportive Facebook group. Come join us. We would love to have you. Have an amazing, amazing weekend, and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye!